Hello, this is Builder Elephant, and welcome back to another review of the Muppets minifigure series. Today, we will be taking a closer look at minifigure number 12, Janice. Janice was originally going to be a male character based on Mick Jagger's extremely thin body and prominent lips. While she is also probably named after musical legend Janis Joplin, by the time Janice made her 1975 debut, she was clearly her own rock star. She is mostly known for being the lead guitarist of the Electric Mayhem Band, but will appear in random sketches outside the group. An argument could be made that she is the most musically talented Muppet. Along with being a master guitarist, she also plays the tambourine, trumpet, and trombone. Good thing these mad musical skills would never go to the head of this laid-back flower child. Janice's leg piece had amazing layers of detail put into each article of clothing. The silver sandals have black soles put on the bottom. Her denim skirt does look more like shorts since it was printed onto the leg piece. However, I can see how a separate mini skirt piece would be problematic, so I'm not bothered by this tiny inaccuracy. I love the intricate design of the belt. The strings woven together look fantastic. The torso piece keeps up this amazing job of capturing all those small details in her outfit. Her pink cropped tank top has long vertical lines running along the shirt. The lines in the front are curved to help give the square minifigure more of the abnormally slim appearance of her character. These lines can also be found on the back. Now while these back lines are straighter, the hair covers most of the pattern anyway. Janice is wearing a turquoise stone necklace. This simple piece of jewelry finishes off the ensemble perfectly. The headpiece looks fantastic. The elongated mouth with the big lips leave little doubt who this Muppet is. The heavy pink eyeshadow with big, thick, black eyelashes do a great job matching the puppet. The tan hat with a flower printed on the front does a great job complementing the overall wardrobe. Lego captured the hippie style and the flower color matches her necklace. The folded brim looks like a piece of fabric instead of hard plastic. As a kid, I've always thought Janice's hair looked like yarn. Now the minifigure managed to capture that thick, stranded look of the puppet and still let us know this is her hair. As the lead guitarist to the Electric Mayhem Band, Janice was given an original guitar piece for her accessory. Now the mold itself is nothing new, but the dark orange plastic with tan coloring and silver strings was a new design. Each guitar has such an individual personality that I love getting this piece in different patterns. It helps give the piece and the character it belongs to the individuality that they need. The Janus minifigure continues that amazing work by the LEGO design team. From a physical perspective, the minifigure is top notch. However, the character choice is a disappointment to me. While I'm assuming we will get the rest of the Electric Mayhem band in future CMF series or sets, Janice herself is lost amongst the larger Muppet cast. When doing my research, the first result for Muppet Janice was, who is the blonde Muppet? I was able to find a lot of information on her from Muppet fan sites. Larger wiki sites simply lumped her into the Electric Mayhem page and didn't bother giving her an individual entry. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe or check out some of our other videos. Until next time, let's keep building together.